Hello everyone and welcome back to episode 46 of Feed the Beasts. Episode 45 was like how many months ago? It is way too long. And I'm I'm deeply uh, deeply sorry, first of all, for not posting any videos. But basically, I've probably been sort of talking about that uh, a couple of times before, sort of explaining what is going on in the state of Feed the Beast. But I think I'm gonna I'm gonna probably just really I'm I'm gonna be continue doing videos uh, first of all with Feed the Beast. Um, not gonna be a whole lot left because I only got a few more ideas I want to really uh, sort of put into the series. And uh, when they're done, I am gonna move on to a new mod pack. But I'm gonna sort of talk about what is going on with. The whole thing, what is my plan for the next mod pack and what will happen with the server and stuff like that. Um, that's at least my plan so far, so in the meantime, I'm gonna be going and I'm probably gonna start up another quarry. Because I think I, I think we need more space, or no, no, not more space, but we need more items. We need, we need more things. And, um, yeah, the glorious 173,000 UU matter is beautiful. And these are not really filled up. We definitely need to fill that up. How many diamonds do we have? Let's quickly check. 1300! Oh my god! <laughs> That's because of quarries. <laughs> I have a huge area of quarries, so... Um... That's pretty cool. So yeah, guys, if you haven't, if you, if you, if you didn't follow the series because maybe you're a new subscriber, uh, this is basically Feed the Beast. It's a mod, it's a mod pack that I, I used to play quite a lot back then. Uh, was reached into 45 episodes and, um, yeah! Basically now is going to be the, the point where I'm going to talk about what is going on and uh, what my plan is for the future. But I'm going to quickly grab some of the things that I need to be able to continue on with the... Um, whoops. Uh, uh, with the series, what will happen with it. Uh, oh, I also need a red torch. Redstone torch, thank you. I, I'm not even, I don't even need that many. I don't only need one, actually. I'm gonna grab, just so I don't end up losing all of them. Okay, there we go. Oh, by the way, this thing. Coin of Fortune. I got that one from... Uh, uh, from, from Kid. He gave me that. Apparently, it automatically just uh, uh, picks up items that's close to you. Like, look at this. If, if I drop this one... I'll have to turn it out first. There we go. That works. I can't basically just... I, I can't... Uh, throwing them away like I keep on picking it up again that's pretty nice so if I accidentally suddenly uh, maybe drop this thing it'll just automatically pop into my inventory again so it's it's pretty cool and also when you're going out mining if you really want to get everything before it falls into lava or something like that then it's definitely really useful um, but yeah and and all in all just basically picking up items um, I'm gonna clearly remember where I have to go because it's it's been such a long time since the last time I played on this server it is it is literally months since the last time I locked on so um, I'm out of training but basically just to quickly talk about what will happen later on in the episode after I'm done with uh, mumbling about what is going on with the future and all of that um, I will be trying to make an automated system for the uh, Emmy system I'm gonna make it so It'll automatically craft items that I need because it's it's getting tired of I'm, I'm tired of just working on something and then suddenly I need an item and then I have to go back and try and remember what recipe it is but I want it all to be automated so I just could, can quickly request it to to automatically make some items for me and god dang it I don't want to be stop it there we go thank you oh there we go oh goody okay um so yeah welcome to the uh to the quarry area we might try and get that and then again there's oral and um uh, quarries and orals uh, uh orals are not really that uh friendly to each other right we got plenty of these okay so uh, i'm just gonna pick this one up first um gotta first of all grab this thing see that's the thing with the uh with the coin it's really helpful when picking up uh, things like this i'm just gonna see if i even remember how to do this again it's been such a long time I'm just gonna grab all these right now. Uh, gonna grab that thing. I'm gonna grab the chest and the uh, the actual quarry machine thing. What is it even called? Yeah, it's just called a quarry. Okay. Uh, where's the last one? I think I had three. Is that no, it's not here. What the heck? Did I did I just remove that or what? Maybe maybe it's lost. Or maybe I put it somewhere else. I don't know. 
Um, oh, well, I guess it's enough. I I can only have like two of them started before I'm done with talking about the whole thing with the future. I think I'm going to take this area for the first quarry, so let's do that. Um, but yeah, um, first of all, I'm, I'm terrible at multitasking, so we're going to be having... Uh, I'm gonna have a fun time trying to to talk while doing this. We'll grab some some dirt to be able to pillar up and making it all stable. So, even though we already have some, so that's that's great. Okay, so um, first thing, feed the beast. This mod pack. Um, as you probably know, it's been something that's been going on for a very very long time, and um, it's something that I have really really enjoyed, and I want to continue doing that. I want to continue doing mod pack videos. Uh, I'm just gonna probably try and move on to the next one. Uh, the reason why I haven't been uploading a whole lot of videos of this is because I, I, I just basically lost the ideas. I didn't really have the, the creative stuff, uh, in me anymore. I didn't, I didn't know new mods that I wanted to, to play around with. And that is not how I do it. I have to put down the marks first. God dang. Again, I forget about stuff like that. I'm just gonna put that there, okay. So, I'm gonna first of all put the... Wait a second. You know what? I'm just gonna put it right there. Yeah. Right there. I'm gonna put the redstone there. There we go. And then we're gonna do this. Perfect. That's a perfect placement right there. But yeah, basically, I've always wanted to completely continue this series, but it's just I've, I've been out of ideas, and I don't want to just be that person that just sits down and do videos just to make videos, because basically this series has probably been one of my most popular series on my channel. Um, at least when it comes to... Oh, whoops, that's the wrong uh, thingy. Uh, at least when it comes to the amount of views and the amount of likes and the amount of people just, just enjoying and keeping on requesting. Because the past couple of months I've been getting private messages, tweets, messages on, on, on my stream, asking what happened to Feed the Beast. Um, and I'm really happy that you guys are, are, are requesting that because it really makes me feel like, oh, I gotta continue this. But again, I didn't just want to make an episode uh, just to make an episode. Like, I, I want it to be quality. I, I want to work on it. I want to have stuff prepared. Um, not because I have a whole lot of stuff prepared for this one, but I do have something that I want to work on. And that's basically what I, what I needed for an episode to be done. Um, and it's, it's, of course, a mix of me being busy with studies and stuff like that, uh, which can be a, a pain in the butt sometimes. Uh, I'm gonna put that right there, I'm gonna put the quarry, or energy, energy tesseract, uh, right next to it. I'm just gonna see if I can get this to work again. Uh, not that thing, I'm gonna use, what do I, can I use that? Okay, there we go, okay. Uh, remember that we have to put it as owner only, and then we just choose one of these, I think? Yes, okay, that's good, that's the one, okay. And now it starts, perfect. Okay, let's put the next one over here. Um, oh, we gotta quickly grab the markers really quickly. Um, so yeah, that's basically the reason why there haven't been any videos recently with uh, Feed the Beast. And um, again, it is my probably most f popular series. So uh, of course I could just go out and just say I'm just gonna upload uh, almost daily videos and and get a lot of video uh, views and stuff like that. Yeah, it's great. Um, but no, it's series like these. I wanna, I wanna keep the quality up and uh, make it uh, keep going and entertaining for you guys. That is at least uh, what I what I at least want and expecting for a series on YouTube. Um, so yeah, don't wanna rush it out. And um, recently, as you probably know, I've been doing yeah again forty five episodes and uh, forty five episodes. I've been doing a whole lot through those episodes and. Uh, Reaching to the point again where the mods are starting to, yeah, I've pretty much discovered almost everything. And then again, yet again, I've I have been actually found a few mods that I might be interested into into checking out um, before I end the uh, Feet to Beast Ultimate Pack series, uh, which is mod pack is on. Uh, if you didn't know that, um, but yeah, the plans for the future. Uh, I'm probably gonna be moving away from Feed the Beast, and I'm gonna f probably actually I'm, I'm thinking about starting two, actually almost three series of modded Minecraft, and um, uh, basically the first thing and that's an idea. It's only an early uh, early plans, but uh, Destin and I, Destin, which is also one of the members of this server, uh, which also played a lot, uh, we've been talking about maybe starting a series of the uh, 
what's it called? Defeat the Beast map called Ar Agrarian Skies, I think it is. Um, which is looking quite interesting. And I've I've been doing, what's it called? Um, Sky Den before. And it's sort of like that. It's just a bit more advanced. And uh, I guess it would be a lot more fun to do that multiplayer. And that's something we've been talking about. It's only in the early stages. And we still need to find time to do that first. Uh, but it's not a guaranteed thing to happen. Um, but it could be fun. I'm going to set this one up there. There we go. Uh, but yeah, that's one of the things. And the other one is uh, a mod pack that Dramkus made. Uh, my good friend Dramkus, he made that uh, uh, some time ago. And uh, he's been playing a lot on it. And it seems like it's all working. So I feel confident on, on starting a series. That will be, though, only single player, though. It's not going to be on server. Um, and then the third series will be maybe becoming a server. It's going to be sort of replacing this server. Uh, where all the members of the Feed Beast team can then, uh, or the Feed Beast server, not the actual Feed Beast team, but the the people on this server, they can join it and they can maybe start another series or maybe just play for fun. Um, at least for now, I'm 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 of course gonna make videos of all three series if if they all happen. Um, I just enjoy watching quarries. I don't know what is going. Quarries are so beautiful. I'm I'm happy. That they've created this. I'm really hoping. I, I haven't been doing a whole bunch of research in Dramkus's mod pack, but I'm hoping there's quarries in that. I don't remember what mod pack it's part of, but it should. No, it doesn't tell that. Okay. Hmm. Maybe we can see that under if we search for it. Crotty, crotty. No, it doesn't. Okay. Maybe Billcraft or something like that. It might be. No, it's not Billcraft. Is it? Is it Billcraft? No, it's not. I don't know. I see two. Hmm. Tools. Advanced machines. It could probably look like that. All these different things. Gatherers. Generators. Processors. Yeah, there's a bunch of stuff. Oh, God. Oh, well. <laughs> uh, but yeah, that's probably going to be the future. Now, uh, when will this... Uh, series and uh, basically we will be uh, at least my, my my plan so far the finale will be uh, with the Dramkis and I we we're gonna be building a uh, a nuclear reactor um, I'm gonna quickly check the uh, I want home back there we go so I can find my way back um, but yeah I'm gonna be uh, doing a nuclear reactor with uh, Dramkus and I've also already been sort of planning it out. You can probably see it in my home where the nuclear reactor is going to be put. Um, and then we'll see if if it'll fa fail, then it, it fails. It's going to be the, the end of the, the series anyway. So in case it blows up, then, well, oh well, it's, it's gone. I'm of course going to make a backup, backup uh, before we record that. Otherwise, it's, yeah, not good. <laughs> um we're going to put it here, and that's going to be the finale. So when you see that, you know that, okay, that's probably going to be the last episode of Feed the Beast until the next version of a mod pack we're going to put up on the server. Or the, the thing that I'm going to play single player. I don't know. I don't know when to do those. Um, I just feel like I want to finish this series off before I start the others. Um, so yeah, when you see that, then you know it's the end. Um... Let's quickly check the core. I'm just going to quickly make sure that it all works again. Uh, I have been having a bit of problems with the server lately. Apparently, it, it doesn't restart automatically. Uh, but it seems like it does actually pump out the Teflon. I look at that. Mm, beautiful. All that dirt. Definitely what we need. What the heck is this? Okay, we got saplings. It doesn't really give us a whole lot. Huh. Maybe it's oh, it's probably still cleaning up. It's not even starting to 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 dig yet, so that's probably why. Uh, I'm gonna quickly first of all before we're gonna uh, cut over and do a little be right back thingy, um, then I will quickly check if I can see if we can find the quarry. Okay, we do have a quarry in here. Do we have an ender chest that would uh, fit one of them? Uh, probably. It's probably one of these. Um, maybe that one, orange, orange, blue. Is that the one? I just want to clearly make sure. The one that doesn't run right now is this one. Is light blue, blue, light blue. Uh, is that one? Or is not that one? Is that one? Oh, I see. Okay, so I got it. Okay, so it's not something that's gone. Okay, that's perfect. Okay. 
Okay, guys, so I will be doing a bit of research because I'm not 100% sure how to do this, but um, I'll be working on that. So we're going to be doing the, of course, automatic building ME system thingy, uh, add-on thingy. I don't know what, what is it extra, exactly called, but um, I'm going to be doing a bit of research before we're going to continue recording. And uh, hopefully that will be going all smoothly through. Um, so yeah, uh, I'll be right back. And so I am now ready to be doing this. It's a bit laggy around here, so I'm sorry about that. But um, down here, we're going to be working on the uh, automatic crafting uh, pattern thingy machine thingy. Um, I've been doing a lot of reading, and holy moly, this is... Uh, uh, this is, uh, yeah, interesting. But I've been doing a lot of crafting, and just to quickly show you what we need. Uh, first of all, we need ME assembler containment walls, which is basically the the case of the entire machine that's going to be doing all the automatic building. Uh, and then also we need some heat vents so it's not overheating. And then we need a CPU to make it uh, craft. The more CPU you put in, the faster it gets. And then we have the pattern provider, which is basically the, the place where you put all the patterns in with the automatic recipes that you want to create. Um, so that's more for storage of the different patterns. And of course, that this doesn't even make any sense. So I'm going to try and do this. I don't know if I've completely understood this correctly, but I'm going to do this. I follow the Applied Energetics website because uh, they have like a whole tutorial, which is was really nice with pictures and all that. It's so good. It's so good. I, even I couldn't understand it, sort of, I think. Um, now, basically, we can make this as small as possible, but I'm going to make this a bit larger than uh, I think they said would be. The, the smallest one is 3x3x3. Three by three by three. I think I'm going to make this... What is that then? 4x4x4? Four by four, four by four? Yeah, 4x4x4. Four by four by four. Yes, okay. I'm going to do that. At least that's what the pictures uh, showed in the tutorial, so I'm going to do that. I don't know if you can make it larger. I think you can. I think you can make it really large. Um, now, I have no idea how many uh, actual uh, recipes you can hold in this one, but... I'm just going to go with this. I think this is going to be looking pretty good. And I don't know why I'm... Oh, God dang it. Um, I'm not sure if I can actually remove that with this. Can I remove this one? Can I just destroy it? I'm hoping I can. Oh, I think I did. Okay, goody. Okay, we're going to put these here. So we're going to start out the actual casing. This is sort of the skeleton of, uh, uh, of how it's going to be looking like. This is going to be this massive block at the end. Uh, which is going to be looking pretty nice. And then I'm guessing we're just going to hook it up to, with an ME cable to the rest of it. I think. I don't even know if that's how you do it. But uh, I'm I'm hoping that's how it works. I haven't been seeing any videos. I decided to just look at the uh, look at the official website. I'm guessing that they probably explained it pretty well. I'm, I'm, I'm feeling comfortable. Or not comfortable, but I'm com uh, ready, at least. Um, okay, so now when we do that, now we're going to put in the... The events and I'm kind of surprised that I've actually cal calculated this correctly we had exactly enough uh, containment wall so that is perfect and that just to let you know this was without the tutorial tutorial say saying how many you needed it just shows some pictures so I calculated it by myself I am I'm very happy <laughs> and proud okay so these are gonna be put I think I calculated this wrong Yes, I did. That's great. Okay, we need a few more vents. That's uh, perfect. Okay, I gotta really make that. Um, so I'm gonna really show you how to do that at least. So we do have a bit of building here. Um, okay, so we need to do uh, heat vents. Okay, here we go. This is the the recipe. We need ME cables. Uh, I'm just gonna. It's also the recipe for the ME crafting CPUs, and then you also saw that. Um, okay, so let's go for iron first. I believe it was like this, and then we're going to use the bars here, like that, and we're going to use ME cables in the middle, I think. Yes, okay, so we need four extra, okay. Four, nice, perfect, okay. So, let's go back here. God dang it, stop it. Eh. There we go. Now we're going to go down here. Oh my god, it's super laggy right now, I'm really sorry about that. That's the thing, recording at this place is but just hard. Oh, God. There's also the bottom. Oh, no, we need four extra. Oh, well, I was going to quickly go back and grab that then. Uh, I'm hoping that I have enough. Yes, I do. Nice. Okay, perfect. Okay, now I got the eight extra. 
Um, God dang. This is too laggy, man. I just not good. Maybe it's something in the background that's doing this. Because didn't really lag the whole lot before when I was explaining myself about the whole situation. Um, okay, and then I think what we do is that I almost... Okay, I calculated this wrong again. I need four of each. God dang it. Oh, well, you're, you guys are going to see how to build this now. Um, and we're going to have the ME sort of patterns. The ME pattern providers. But we're need, we need two of each. So I had to get four in total of each. So that was good. Okay, perfect. I yet again failed my calculation. That is perfect. Hmm. I don't know what I was thinking. God dang it. All right, so we need to make the CPU first. I'm hoping that I have enough materials to be able to do this. Uh, okay, so now we got that one going. Okay. Um, oh, God. Do I have enough glowstone? I'm hoping I have. Do I? Yes, I do. But not a whole lot. Uh, what else? Uh, cr crystal? Do we need that? I believe we did. And then we need what else? We need that advanced uh, ME thingies. Okay. Got plenty of those. Okay, so we just need two of these. Okay. There we go. And then we got... What else do we need? It was the uh, pattern provider thingy. Pattern provider. Yes, sir. Okay, I should have an ad going. Yeah. Um, wait a second. That was almost uh, done. I shouldn't have removed that one. Okay. Oh, God. Do I really have that? I don't think I do have all of those. ME storage ones. Wait, was that the correct one? Storage cell. Do we have one of those? God dang, we don't have that. Okay, well, I'm going to quickly make that then. Storage cell. Great. Oh, God. Okay, welcome to uh, crafting with uh, Gamma Bomb here. That is going to be beautiful. Okay, storage cell. Oh, that. Okay. Do I have more of those? Again, very good Christian. And of course we don't. Oh, God. All right, guys. I'm going to be right back. I'm going to quickly just craft that because that's going to be super boring to watch. So I'll be right back. And so we return to this. Okay, so now I pretty much got all those items. Uh, decided that I want to really show that in case I've already I've already showed it to all the other stuff. So why not just also show this uh, crafting taper? Which we actually exactly got two of, so that so that was perfect. Um, then we need the conversion matrix, which I I'm pretty sure I have. I, I'm hoping, otherwise that is going to be s not a coin. Con. There we go. There we got it. Okay. And then we need ME with the advanced processor. I believe it was. Yes, it is. And then we need the storage one, which we which we just make it made a bunch of them. There it is. There we go. Okay, two of them. Bye. Okay, now we should be ready. Okay. Holy moly, that was, uh... That was, uh, a bit more work than I thought it would be. But okay. Let's, uh, put those there. And let's put the, uh... The pattern providers right in there. There we go. Bam. And then we're gonna put the, uh, the rest of the heat vents in it. And then it should transform if I've done it correctly into a big uh, giant block. Okay, here we go. Oh, look at that, mm, beautiful. Mm, damn, and then we can right click on it and then we have a bunch of pages where we can put the different patterns into. Now, the thing we're gonna do now is we're gonna make a pattern encoder. Uh, seems pretty easy. And then also we're gonna make blank pattern. We don't have a whole bunch of glowstone, and that's going to be probably the only problem that we have right here. But we're just going to really sort of get it to work and see if I can even get it to work. Because I haven't really been reading a whole lot about that, uh, where you actually start making the pre recipes. But I, I, I want to try it out. I want to see if I can do this. Okay, so the first thing we're going to make is the pattern, uh, uh, the pattern encoder. And that's how you do that. That just seems... Wait a second, is that... No, yeah, okay. Crafting... Oh, we got to really make a crafting table. <laughs> Oh my god. Uh, oh, that's not how you'd say that. It's plank. Thank you. It's uh, weird that I'm suddenly apparently having to make a bunch of uh, crafting table. Oh, we got an achievement. Benchmarking. Yay. That's perfect. Okay. Yay. Okay. Let's uh, 
grab one of these. Okay, we only need to make one of these actually. Uh, and then we're gonna make, uh, not make, but we're gonna grab some iron ingots. And in the iron ingot field in there, we're gonna get the matrix. Wait, isn't the crafting table in there? I think that's how, yeah, it is, okay. I'm pretty sure we only need one of these. Okay, so we're gonna do that. And then we're gonna make the blank pattern. We're only gonna make a few of these because we're just gonna sort of get the idea. And then of course, not grass, good dang. Um, I'm, I just need to get the idea of how do this all works. And of course, I'm gonna be working on that off camera. Because uh, we don't have a, look at that, we only got 18 glowstone left. Which reminds me, I need to go to the nether and farm some of that. Okay, quartz crystal, which we had to put where? Was that the place? I'm pretty sure it is. And then iron on the bottom. Yes, it is. Okay, I was going to make a few of these. Bam, six of those. We don't have any more glowstone. Great. Okay. And then over here, this should be an encoded assembler pattern. This is basically a pattern that's already encoded. Uh, now, how this works... I am not sure. I'm not sure if this uh, encoded or, or pattern encoder, I don't know if that needs to be connected to the uh, ME system, but I'm, I'm going to do it. I'm gonna, of course going to do it. So I'm going to be putting it right next to this thing. And uh, now that reminds me I need to get some ME cables, which I'm really hoping that I have some of. I only got six. Great. Okay, so we should be able to just extend this one and sort of have it go down there. Um, at least connect that one, but doesn't want to connect the pattern connect. Maybe it doesn't even need to do that. Oh, look at that. I don't think it, it needs that. Oh, well, never mind. And I don't want it to put it like that. I'm going to put it just directly into that. There we go. Bam. Mm. Okay. Oops. That's not what I want. God dang it. My computer is super laggy right now. It's because I'm using uh, OBS to record right now with Minecraft because DxTory is uh, a big poop right now with Minecraft, so I'm using OBS instead. I probably will have to move over to Fraps, which I'm hoping that I, I don't want to. <laughs> okay, so what are we going to build? What are we going to do? What are we going to do as our first thing? It's going to be a really, it's going to be a really important thing. I want to make my very first thing. And I think the thing I'm going to make, hmm, it is of course going to be, yeah, what is it, is it going to be? I have no idea. It needs to be something good, something useful. What am I always tired of? I'm, I'm always tired of making, uh, what's it called? Pistons. Pistons are always a, wait, isn't that how? Piston. Oh, there we go. Uh, yeah. Regular pistons. Can you stop that? There we go, thank you. That is always annoying to have, or have to make. So, I'm gonna make that. And I already forgot how to make that, okay. Uh, planks. Gonna grab some of those. Okay. What else we need? Copper stone. This is like one of those simple things that should be so damn easy to make. But yet again, so annoying to... Because I keep on forgetting the pattern, or the, the actual uh, recipe for it. We need some iron and we need redstone, which is right there. There we go. Okay, and now it should be ready. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to put, I'm guessing, a pattern there. And then we're going to put uh, this in here. There we go. And then I guess I'm going to put that in there. And then we're going to, wait, are we supposed to put, I think we have to go there and then encode. And then this one now has a piston where it says what it needs. And then I'm guessing we're going to right click on this thing and then we're just going to put in the pattern in there. And now the exciting part. Oh god, I'm I'm really excited about this. Oh god. Um Okay, let's see this. Okay, come on. Can we do this? Okay, piston. We've already got 19. I'm going to take those out. Oh, look at that! Craft. And then we click on that. Oh, nice! Oh, sweet! And now we can basically choose how many uh, pistons we want to create. So we can, like, say, oh, well, I need ten of those. Begin. And they've created it already. Be beautiful. <laughs> I'm happy I actually successfully 
did this. It is beautiful. Oh my god, I'm happy. I'm happy today. Look at that. And then 29. That is that's gonna be so much fun. I'm I'm off camera for the next episode. You're gonna be seeing uh either maybe even a bigger block of the actual uh, uh crafting uh thingy. This this thing. Uh this thing, maybe I'm even gonna make a bigger one and that can contain even more recipes. And I'm just gonna fill it up with everything so I don't need to craft anything anymore. <laughs> oh, this is be why didn't I do this before? Wait, 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 second. Can I do it from here? Oh, that would be so cool. Yes, I can! Nice! Hey, we're gonna make 64, of course. No, I'm not, no. Let's make four. There we go. <laughs> oh, it is, it is so much fun. I don't know why I didn't do this before. Like, seriously, wow. I could have saved a whole bunch of time. Wow. Okay, so, um... That is probably going to be it for this episode. I'm probably, for the next episode, we're going to be, uh, I don't know what I'm actually going to be doing, but I have a few ideas. I'm going to, of course, going to be doing a bit of research to be completely clear, clear about it. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed this episode. It's going to be, it, it's probably a bit long episode and it, it was a bit too talky and stuff like that. So I'm sorry about that. But uh, don't worry, there will be episodes of Feed the Beasts. And uh, again, when you finally see the video where there's going to be uh, Dramkus and I are gonna be building the uh, uh, what's it called the uh, I forgot what it's called nuclear reactor. Then you know that that's probably gonna be the last episode of the series. So I hope you enjoyed it. I will see you guys next time on Feet to Beast episode 47. I think it is. Yes, it is. Okay. So thanks for watching. Make sure to leave a like if you enjoyed it, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye bye. <laughs>